my old number 21. My old number 21. 21. Choo choo. Yeah. Right in there, mama. Right in there. I just need a stove, Pat. Watch your eyes. Well, okay. What we're doing? Well, we're we're burning a cast iron. And you're talking to yourself. And I'm talking to myself on video. Got some light in the shed, shining this way. Fire's twitching away. I got this big mother log in there. And. Uh, Talking. They're talking. There we go. A little bit of a wood pile. And uh, yep, that's what we're doing. I'll make a little video on how to burn. Eh, my buddy Phil treated the. Uh, what the heck you call this? Pan? Cast, cast iron. Cast iron pan. Fry pan. Fry pan. Number six. With, um, is there a brand on it? It's number six. A... Can't really tell, yeah. can we? Yeah. All I see is the number six and the number SK. SK. But that, that used to belong to my grandmother. So. <laughs> it's a pan for life. Yep. And you burn it like that. And what it does, the metal softens up a little bit and the yeah. grease gets into the oil, yeah. or? It, it uh, cures it, then. Uh-oh. You're gonna have to use your paw there, Cass. Reach up. Your ball's under the trailer. Well, we'll update you guys when... As you can see, uh, Sarah sometimes leaves it in the water and... A little bit too long. Me, I just wash it and I put it on the stove. That's it. Turn the burner on for a minute or two and, you know. And even hot water, you just turn it Nothing right really now. sticks to it anyway. No. Not if it's well treated. There we go. Oh, wow. It filled the hole, eh? Eh? Okay. Looks like it filled the hole. Mm -hmm. We have to put a little bit of grease on the... Uh... But you can see where it's black. Too. Yeah, absolutely. And we stoked the fire and filled and retreated the pan, as you can see. And it's coming all right. It's an outside job for sure. Mm -hmm. One of ways to uh, control uh, bugs when you're out there in the backyard. One way is to uh, light up a Horton tray and it'll smutter away and keep the bugs away and now back to our pan wow look at that eh? that's what your third fourth time you're third, I think. <laughs> as a bonus the stove gets it too <laughs> when did I think of that Bringing this contraction out. I think I did that Monday. And I backed up the tractor up to the... Well, they closed up uh, Dennis, Dennis's garage there. 
Oh, yeah. oh, it's going to be really nice. Yeah. Yeah, it's a big rash, holy fuck. But if he's got to work on his car or something, he's got the blade. Oh, yes he does. Aha. Uh -huh. <laughs> hot, hot, oh. hot, 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 hot. Waterproofing. Oh yeah, you can see where she uh, cured onto the stove, right? Yeah. Had a chimney collapse a while ago there. You should have seen that, guys. Mm -hmm. Yeah. It's a redneck chimney setup I got. I'm planning on changing those pipes anyway, so. And how are we doing with that Tim Horton thing? Well, almost down to a... Yeah, freaking dress wide open. We're gonna go home smelling like yeah. lard. Like pigs. <laughs> like pigs. <laughs> <laughs> and there's the finished product. Well, I took off that Yankee stuff there. <laughs> no pun intended, guys. Redneck. Yeah. So we went out and body damper. Working the very best. It's even straight. And uh, I put two lengths. She'll have a better draft. And now <clears throat> I got a drop a couple of bolts hold things together and um, so I got that issue there just wobble 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 so uh, I don't know I'm gonna see there if I can take this off to show you for a minute and I got it off I had pre-drilled this before but I didn't notice you guys could help me out with that, but I don't see any screws. <clears throat> any place you can screw this thing. You know what I mean? There's no place to put any screws. I realize that when it's mounted on the house, that you've got a you know a stove pipe from from the base here right up to the ceiling. And then that keeps it you know from the collar up on the ceiling. Sure. But uh, it doesn't fix my wagon over here, that's for sure. Because they still got a tendency of the thing leaning or falling. So, I think what I'm going to do is I started it a little bit. And I'm going to keep drilling this so I can put a drive a screw in there. It'll keep the uh, stovepipe steady. If I manage to make one in the back, maybe I can make one in the front too. Two screws out of holder. But there she is. Vicious is together. And yeah, it's... It rained. And it's still raining. A little bit. So, yeah, can you do? Morning to you. <laughs> There. The only thing I need is a rain cap. Uh, as soon as I find one somewhere. I put the screws to it. On both sides. So. <clears throat> Light this baby up. See what. Huh? Quicker than I thought. Alright. Awesome. But pull that little more to it. And of course, the table's all wet. How well, much you guys can see? Dry it up a little bit. 
bit. Um, no, that's okay because when he makes a fire, guess where he goes, right? He's got a stove pipe there, and I don't think I can zoom in on it, but it's lined up to where you guys are looking. And uh, over there, when they make a fire, um, guess where the smoke comes. Right here, baby. So, goes around, comes around. Me, it's going to be once in a while. I do miss every day in the winter. So, and when Sarah's got clothes on the line, usually they make a fire too. So, that's really enjoyable. Yeah, thank you. Come on, you. Hey, too much hair, not enough hair. What's the deal? Smoke. Ah. Okay. But at least it's up. I'm glad I took this off. Holy crap. <laughs> that was downright dangerous. Put a screw in the center, in the bottom, and I put another one in the back. Keep this from tipping over. So, yeah. All right. Oh yeah. <laughs> Oh yeah, <laughs> now that put a damper on this. Arrête de mouiller, c'est bon ça. Je suis fini à temps. Yep, it's finished just in time. You see there when this thing is cooking, working. It's hard to tell now because the steam there off the rain, but it's raining. I put an upside down Tim Horton can. Fit it right on there. Just to show you, I don't know if I'll find something in town, but uh, somebody's got them, I just ain't not finding them yet. So I guess that'll do for now.